good morning everybody and welcome again to toast time hope you've got your toast ready and you're going to enjoy the next few minutes with us but look i think sid's feeling a little bit fed up today aren't you <laughs> yeah i know come on sid come on out you come and say hello to the children okay that's good well you might be wondering why sid's feeling a little bit fed up today yeah, it's because he's got to play inside. It's raining outside again and it's really windy. Would have been good for the kite climb though, wouldn't it, Sid? <laughs> yeah, it would. It'd been really good. But instead, here we are inside and Sid's got his friends to play, haven't you? <laughs> yeah. So, look here, he's got his friends. He's got Barney Bear and he's got Nelly. <laughs> And he's got, my goodness, this is a big one. It's nearly as big as you, isn't it, Jester? Yeah, so here we are. We have got, how many bears have we got? How many friends have you got here? One, two, three. Yeah, we have, haven't we? And we've been having lots of fun, haven't we? Well, you don't think it's quite so much fun. I know it's not quite so much fun as being outside, but we've still been having some fun, haven't we? Yeah. You want to show them the game? Okay, so look, we have here a good car. And you want to put the balls in. Sid loves this, so look, let's put the balls in. One. How many balls? In you go, in you go. Come on, Sid. Two. And the last one. How many was that then? That was three, wasn't it? Three balls we've got. Okay, so what else have you been playing with, Sid? They'll like the dinosaurs. They will like the dinosaurs. Shall we show them a picture of our dinosaurs? And how many dinosaurs can you see on the picture? And what else? Oh, the cars. Yes, because we think you like playing with cars, don't you? So again, how many cars can you see up on the screen? One, can you count them? Two and three. Okay, what else have we been playing with? Oh yes, the jigsaws. Yep, here we go. We've had lots of fun with the jigsaws, haven't we? And again, we've got one. How many have we got? Two with the cars. And, oh yes, Sid, get it, get it. Can you get it? Oh, there we go. And number three, three jigsaws. Oh, I think that's just about... Oh, the books. Sid likes to have a story before he goes to bed. So here's the books. And again, we've got three different ones. We've got Georgie's racing car. We've got Dear Zoo. And we've got Gobbly Goat. So there's all six toys. I just hope. I just, yes, you're, yeah. We'll have a story later, maybe, Sid. Not quite just now. But I hope, Sid, that you're going to put all these toys away when we're finished. <laughs> yes, you will. Well, that's really good. So, did you spot the connection? We had three bears, three balls, three books, three jigsaws. What else was there? Can you remember? What else did was Sid play with? <laughs> oh, the cars, three cars, and oh, the dinosaurs. Yeah, we've got them all, haven't we? So lots of things in threes. Well, that reminded me a little bit about how we can know God in different ways. And if you think about it, we can know God right from the start of creation. Because God made the wonderful world that we live in, doesn't he? And so we've known God all through history. And every time we're out in the garden and looking around, we can enjoy God's creation. So we know God in that way. But then we also, yeah, I've got the book, I've got the book. We've also got our Bible story book, haven't we? Which Sid likes to read. Are you going to help me hold it, Sid? Thank you. Which we like to read each week. And in that, we see the stories of Jesus, don't we? How, how God came to earth as a human person like us and so we could see him teaching the people and healing and helping the people so we can learn about God through Jesus and in that way and then last week we heard
heard about how God came in this Holy Spirit. How the wind, uh, that's right, the wind and what else? Uh, 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 the fire. Well done, Sid, you've remembered. And how we can expect, uh, 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 you want to see the experiment? Uh, 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 you want to show them? Okay, uh, hang on a minute and we'll just go into my kitchen and we're going to show you uh, a little, not exactly an experiment, but we're going to show you something, okay? Let's have a look. Yeah, we're in the kitchen. So, Sid wanted to show you this little thing. So, if we get some water out the tap, here we go. We have water, don't we? Yeah, liquid. That's right. Tell them, yeah, if I put it in the freezer over here. Come on then, Sid, open the door. In we go. Can you find the ice? There we go. Oh, there we are. And what do we have here? Be a bit cold, Sid, but there you go. That's oh, that's ice. But if we come over here and we wanted to make a cup of tea, you're quite amazed by this, aren't you, Sid? We've got steam. So water, ice, steam, all the same, but in three different forms. Yeah, and that's how we can know God in different ways, isn't it? Great. Okay, I hope you enjoyed that. So I'll just remind you of how we experience God in creation around us. We can get to know God and his character by learning about Jesus and reading the Bible. And we experience the presence of God. Yeah, it's good, isn't it? It's really great that we experience the presence of God with us every day if we want to have him in our lives, which is the fantastic news. So... Yeah, let's do the goodbye song. I think, Sid, let's have your feet. Do you think they'll work? Shall we get your, your feet up to do it? So, goodbye everyone, goodbye everyone, glad you were here. Goodbye everyone, goodbye everyone, glad that you were here. I, 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 glad that you were here. So we're glad you've come to join us again and we'll see you next week. Bye bye. I hope you've cheered up now. So you feel better? Great.